So your straight leg work is going to be hip flexion in the front, abduction to the side, and then extension to the back. The idea with this is to be strict with your body so you can actually work your appropriate range and not cheat. So if you hold something for balance, get to the foot that you're gonna work out in front of you and toes pointed towards the ground. So you're actually flexing your toes, trying to curl them. From there, the best way to approach this is to squeeze both quads. So pressing your quads straight is gonna get them locked into place. And then from there, you're just going to poke out to here. Now that is my active range. So coming up to here, keeping both quads squeezed as tight as I can, that's as high as my leg goes. Active range is different than like uh, passive range. So passive range for me can actually be up here, like six foot to a seven foot high kick. But when I actively try to engage, I can only get out to here. So with this straight leg work circuit, you're going to pump 10 reps out front, very controlled, and then a 10 second squeeze. As you're here, make sure you're squeezing both legs. Don't let this one bend to try to get a higher range, okay? From there, you move on to abduction, still holding your balance, toes pointed, and then trying to lock your core here and not actually go out, but stand up straight and then just kick. So 10 reps here, and then same thing, 10 second hold. And then the back side, again, not trying to lean over too much, but being here, both legs straight again, and then just kicking back a little bit. You're not gonna get a hell of a lot of range with this one, but you'll be squeezing the glutes big time. 10 reps, 10 second hold, squeezing both. Um, that's your straight leg work.